Hey, how's everyone doing? Just doing a quick video because I got a couple of new uh, additions to the tank last night. Got this Sunshine Peacock right here. Really nice color. The blue on him is just like a sweet metallic blue. Looks really cool. If everyone get out of his way. Sorry for the glare. Sun's really shining in this morning into my window here. And I guess I should have closed the shade, but. And then up in this corner here, I got a smaller ruby red peacock. Pretty nice color on him for a small guy. Should really color up nice. He's kind of skittish and up in the corner, but I'm sure he'll mix in just fine eventually. Another shot of the ruby or of the sunshine peacock. Other than that, nothing new in the tank. Just uh, it's a little dirty. Be doing my cleaning either today or tomorrow. Man, sorry for the glare. This is uh, turning out not to be that great of a video, but anyway. I'm going to take some of these smaller ones out of this tank, I think, and i got a tank in the basement I can put them into. Um, if you guys have been following my videos, you know that I'm pretty new to African cichlids, so I'm learning fast, but, um, you know, I bought some at the beginning not knowing what I was doing, and now, you know, some of them just aren't... My, my goal was to have really colorful fish. That's kind of why I switched over to Africans. And uh, some of them just, I don't know if they're females and don't show color or if they're going to just grow out and show color later, but I don't think I'm going to get rid of them yet. Um, but like here's one for example, I'm not sure even what he is, if some of you can help me on some of these fish. Here's another one here, looks like he's got some potential for color, the one that's in between the rocks there. And this guy back there. You know, some of these smaller ones I'm going to probably just put into a different tank for a while and see what happens, see if they do color up. I, I'm really overstocked. Here's another one here. Although I do like this guy's orange fins. And then uh, this, I'm pretty sure this is a female. Um, the one with the two black dots on her, or three of some sort, but maybe not. So if any of you guys, some of these fish I've been pointing at here, if you can tell me what they are, if they're females or whatever, that'd, that'd help me out too. But... Um, this guy up here but anyway I'm overstocked but I'm purposely doing that uh, by recommendation of many to decrease the aggression I know a lot of people don't buy into that but um, with Africans I uh, I think it's the way to go a lot of my local fish stores and their display tanks do it so I'm doing it um, but yeah got the new fish um, thinking about uh, changing around the hardscape a little bit Here's my pseudo pullet. He doesn't come out very often. Right now he's more blue, but when depending on the aggression, sometimes this guy's main body is almost white and then his head is like black. You can see it's kind of two-tone blue right now. It's really cool how it changes, but I'd like to catch him on video sometime when it's when his color's different. So um other than that, not much else is going on. Here's my boy that I really like. It's one of the mixtures that I, mutts that I got last week. Um, there's the tank boss, Venustus. Looking good. Alright, well, let me know. Comment, subscribe, rate. Share this video with your friends. I'm always looking for new subscribers. But I know that's not what it's all about either. Um, give me your thoughts. Thanks.